Cat litter tracking is the single most frustrating thing about being a cat parent, especially for someone that likes to keep their home clean. I am the cat butler, and my ragdoll cats, Timo and Aria, used to track cat litter all over the house. But over the years, after trying all kinds of cat litter, I was able to finally find a solution to eliminate cat litter tracking for good. So today, I'm going to share tips on how to stop cat litter tracking and the solution I use in my home. The best thing you can do to stop cat litter tracking is choosing the right cat litter. When choosing a low tracking cat litter, you should look for cat litter that is heavier and larger in size. Pellets that are heavier and larger tend to not stick to your cat's paws as opposed to cat litter that are more sand-like. My goodness, there's a lot of tracking with this cat litter. Let's see Timo and Aria demonstrate the different types of cat litter. You can see that the corn and cassava cat litter tracks quite a bit. The tracking on the corn and cassava cat litter was so bad that it took three days afterwards to get rid of the litter around the house. Pine and tofu cat litter barely track at all. Only one litter piece. Aria did enjoy playing with the pine litter. She can be very cute. Amazing, almost no litter tracking. Of all the cat litter I've tried, I have found pine and tofu cat litter the best at reducing tracking around the house, with tofu cat litter being easier to clean and better at odor control. Tofu cat litter is made from soybean byproduct and is a clumping cat litter that is soft on your cat's paws and is small enough to allow your cat to dig and cover up their poop. Whereas pine litter is harder to clean has bad odor control. Pine litter is made from shavings from lumber yards and dehydrated and formed into pellets. You can see that the litter pellets are too big for the cats to dig and cover up their poop. Oh, that smells. Cleaning is also not easy because pine litter turns into sawdust when the cat pees on it. Team out. You just like to go to the bathroom when we are filming, huh? You can see that it turned into sawdust, and it takes multiple scoops to clean if you have a regular litter box. So in our house, I use tofu cat litter. It has been a game changer. Tofu cat litter has reduced cat litter tracking, made cleaning a breeze, and kept the smell down. No more stepping on cat litter around the house, or finding cat litter on the sofa. I highly recommend it. If you want to check out the tofu cat litter I use, I'll link it in the description below. The second thing you can do to stop cat litter tracking is choosing the right litter box. A large litter box with high walls can help limit litter from flying out when the cat jumps out of the litter box. Moreover, a larger litter box will also be more comfortable for your cat when it goes to the bathroom and give it room for your cat to dig and cover their poop. Some cats can be messy diggers and high walls help to keep the litter in. Another type of litter box is a top entry litter box. It is even better at making sure cat litter does not fly out when the cat jumps out of the litter box. Cats must enter and leave through the top of the litter box. As they jump out of the litter box, most of the cat litter stays in the litter box. while the holes on the top of the litter box keep any stray litter from coming out. 
this litter box may not be the right choice for older cats, as they may have trouble jumping out of the litter box. Timo and Aria use a top entry litter box. Combined with the tofu cat litter, there is almost no tracking. In addition, I like this litter box in particular because it has a removable liner that makes cleaning easier. You can remove the bag made out of tarp and just wash it. If you're interested in a top entry litter box, I'll link it in the description below. The third thing you can do to reduce cat litter tracking is getting a litter mat. Litter mats trap cat litter from your cat's paws as they exit the litter box before they can track them around the house. You want to choose a mat with ridges or a honeycomb design to catch more litter. In terms of texture, you want one that is easy to clean, skid resistant, and one's comfortable for your cat. Vacuum the litter mat often so litter doesn't build up. I personally don't use a litter mat because the top entry litter box in conjunction with tofu cat litter is so effective at reducing cat litter tracking. A litter mat would be a good investment if you have a regular litter box. The last thing you can do to control litter tracking is litter box placement. In your home, you can put the litter box in a less trafficked area or in a separate room, away from the main living area, so it can reduce tracking in the places you see the most. Consider setting up your litter box in an uncarpeted area if you have one. Litter sticks to carpet much more tightly than it does to hard floors. I live in an apartment, so I put Timo and Arya's litter box in the corner of the room and has kept litter away from the main areas. If you enjoyed this video so far, please consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell. We make videos on helping you become the best cat owner, so please join us. Even if you follow every recommendation, a bit of litter tracking can still happen. You'll still have to regularly clean the litter box and the surrounding area, so keep a vacuum nearby. One thing that has made cleaning easier for me is a robot vacuum. It has been a game changer. I set the robot vacuum to clean once per day, and as a result, my floors in my apartment are spotless. It's also good at keeping the floors clean of cat hair. I used to spend about 30 minutes every day vacuuming my living space. Now, I get that time back. I hope that these tips help you reduce cat litter tracking in your home. Implementing the majority of the tips will reduce cat litter tracking tremendously, with choosing the right cat litter being the most important. After using tofu cat litter for over three years, it truly has been the solution to cat litter tracking in my home, while also being low dust, easy to clean, and safe for my cats to accidentally eat. Timo and Arya, are you a fan of tofu cat litter? I think so. I'll link the tofu cat litter in the description below. Comment down below, how do you reduce cat litter tracking around your house?